Wait a minute, fat boy. You lost your shares to the bank. You don't even have a right to be here. Gee, funny you should bring that up. Because I'm not sure that you have the right to be here. What have we got here? Oh, my God, it's a police report. Well, what's all this about? Let's see. Paul Barish, married May 1993 to Beverly Barish, a.k.a. Beverly Burns. Richard, how could Beverly be married to Paul and my dad at the same time? Interesting. Yes, yeah, provocative. <laughs> what I think it means is your marriage to my dad was never legal. Which also means that Beverly's shares still belong to Tommy. Isn't that right, Mr. Rittenhauer? Yes, I believe that's right, Mr. Riley. I'd say that's right, Mr. Gilmore. Oh, absolutely. And let me guess, you're not going to be selling me the company now, are you, Tommy boy? No, sir. Ray, I have no idea what they're talking about. That's it. I'm not going to take this. Uh uh It's not over yet, Lee Harvey. Let's see. Warrants outstanding. New Mexico. Mail fraud. Colorado. Wire fraud. And coming soon to Ohio, computer fraud. Get him! Don't let him leave the complex, Marty. Hey! Hey, you forgot your wife! Screw you! Screw all of you! Crash test in progress. Not good. Hit the brakes! That will ruin his weekend. Well, kid, you threw one by me. Savor the flavor, because it sure as hell won't happen again. In the meantime, good luck to you. Thank you, sir. Marty, got to check the Callahan Auto for those brake pads. Yes, sir. And you. All this excitement around here, I kind of got a little hungry. Want to step over to my club and we'll grab something to eat? Oh, oh, oh. Thank you. I'd like that. Good. Marty, find out where the police will be taking them. Send over a bottle of bubbly with a bucket of ice and a card. Have it say, tough break, get drunk on me, use the bucket of ice down your marbles, here's Z. Well, Mr. Callahan, looks like we're back in business. Yes, sir, Mr. Rittenauer. That's great, Tommy. That's great, Tommy. Thanks. Way to go, Tommy Callahan. <laughs> Ugh, that was pathetic. Shut up, Richard.